We'll be checking to make sure there's not something the government is actually doing that exacerbates the problem. This edition of the Riddler Report is brought to you by ShireSociety.com. You with the Army? Question for you. To what extent have the torture scandals made it harder for you to do your job? No clue what you're talking about. <laughs> um, Bagram Air Force Base torture scandal, Babur Griab torture scandal, the WikiLeaks massacre video. Has that made it harder for you to do your job? I'd prefer not to comment. This I thought you might say that. Are you gentlemen on the Weeds Committee? Yes, we are. Question. Sure. Does New Hampshire really have to have a Weeds Committee? Well, it's not just weeds, it's invasive species. Well, it would take a week for me to say the name of the committee. It's That's how many things are listed. <laughs> <laughs> Well, you know, it started out as one or two things, and then as we got more uh, contamination, I guess is the best word, more invasive species coming in, and there's more coming in all the time, and uh, there's more to deal with. We've broadened the scope of the committee to include animals as well as weeds. So. Will you be checking to make sure there's not something... <coughs> Excuse me. Sorry, bless you. We'll be checking to make sure there's not something the government is actually doing that exacerbates the problem. We do look at that. Years ago, we used to do that. We used to, uh, from milfoil is, is the, the classic case, we used to cut it up, mow it underwater, and pull it out. And what we were doing is breaking it up into little pieces and making it spread. We didn't know that. The authorities were doing that? They were hiring marinas and other people were hiring outfits to do that. Okay. And some people thought that was a much better deal than putting some sort of herbicide into the water, and in some cases, maybe that's true. Uh, there's a restriction on the use of herbicides, so. All right, and what's your name? Chris Christensen. Okay, Mr. Christensen, thanks for your time. Thank you. Who, who are you? It's Dave Ridley, RidleyReport.com. Oh, okay. Yeah, poor man's TV station. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> are you on the weeds committee? Uh, yeah. Question for you. Uh, what, if anything, will you be doing on this committee to make sure I, I'm late for Tom O'Brien, the president of the New Hampshire Lakes Association, and proud uh, to be part of any committee that uses words like, years ago I did a one hour documentary with Amy Slavula on combating milfoil in the Washington Waterfront. 2,000 Liberty lovers have moved to New Hampshire for the Free State Project. But there's a saying, my saying actually, united we stand, divided we rise. If you think the Free State Project is too centralized or restrictive, Join the Shire Society instead. They're also recruiting people to move to New Hampshire, but they're decentralized and have no board of directors. ShireSociety.com